Are you ready to cover three difficult sounds in English which are commonly confused? Our sounds today are R, L, and all. So the two types of L sounds and the R sounds. So we're just going to practice those, learn the differences between them, learn the mouth positions, and hopefully by the end of the video you'll be able to use a sentence with all those sounds. Great. So let's first go with R sound. R, like red. Really. So it's not like other languages, say maybe Russian, French, where you have a more kind of rolled R, like I can't even do it. It's not like this. It's more like r, r. So literally, if you imagine your tongue, your it just goes r, r, pointing backwards. Top of the mouth, it goes r, r, just like that. So let's practice it. Really red rendezvous. Couldn't think of anything, so I went for a French word. Okay, now let's go on to our two different L sounds. These sounds are different, and you've got to know the difference and know when to use the right one. So the first L sound is like this, L, L, and you should be able to feel the difference between R and L. Hopefully you hear it. But most of all, the tongue position, L, L. Unlike the other sound, R, which points back, this points forwards your tongue, L. L. So it is literally just the tongue touching the top of the mouth. L. L. Okay, let's do some practice of that sound. So, lime. Lime. Like the fruit. Lemon. Lemon. Also like the fruit. And one last word. Limousine, limousine, like the long posh car that you drive to weddings and so on, at least in the UK. Okay, and finally, this mysterious sound, oh. You often find this at the end of words with double L, oh, oh. So, how, how do we make this sound? Good question. Your tongue points, just like R, towards the back of your mouth. But this time, it stays there for the whole sound. So instead of going like this for R and L, it goes O, O. The tongue stays stuck to the top of your mouth. O, O. So great. Um, let's think of some words. The classic ones are like ball, full, and so on. So I hope you know the differences between these three different types of sounds. And let's let's do a little funny practice of those sounds. I really like. something. Okay, I've got it, I've got it. I really like my pals. I really like my pals. So, like friends, right? Pal like friends. So, thank you very much for watching. Well done for getting to the end of the video. I really would like to hear from you which sounds you're struggling with, and anyone who's feeling 
particularly motivated can write below a sentence with all three of those sounds. I would be very impressed if you managed it. Okay, don't forget to subscribe and see you soon.